Hi everyone, my name is Jenny Woolsey and this month is Craniofacial Acceptance Month. At the moment I'm talking about community involvement and part of community involvement is the beginning of school. Here we call it pre-prep, some places they call it kindergarten, but it's your early childhood setting. The children are around three or four, it's before they go to primary school or elementary school and they are learning how to write their name, colours, you know, they may do cooking, sand play, and lots of activities to help them get ready for school. When our children, Melissa and Nick, went to pre-prep, we found out not too long after they were there, that the other children were noticing their facial difference. The other children were making comments about their faces. The centre contacted us and said what was happening and that they wanted to address the issue very quickly. And what they did by their own initiative was they did a series of lessons and sessions on what is a face. You know, they looked at the components of a face and they looked at how faces are all different in some way. That had a dramatic effect. The children just went, oh, okay. So Melissa's face is just a bit different Nicholas's face is just a bit different. It's no big deal. All faces are different. We're not going to, we won't say anything to them about their eyes. And life went on. The children had friendships. They loved going. They were accepted. And it was a really good environment for them to be in. They both flourished and loved going to pre-prep. I encourage you, if your children are three or four and they're in an educational early childhood setting and the other kids do start to say something, ask the centre, the management, the teacher, to do some lessons on faces and how faces are the same, but how faces are different as well. Look at the shape of eyes, the mouths, the hair, ears. And that way, the children will go, okay, because children at that age are sponges and they will take it on board and they will accept that your child is like them, they just have a difference and that's okay. And they will see past the face and they will see the child within because that's what happened with my children. My name is Jenny Woolsey. I'm a author, speaker, teacher and artist. I have the motto, be weirdly wonderful, embrace your disability and differences. Again, if you are enjoying my videos, please like, comment and share. My next lot of videos I'm going to be doing are going to be talking about school. So I will see you next time.